If pretty was a person. Oh my, it's a wide on a mic. Hello beautiful besties and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time watching, I'm Sheree. Welcome. If you happen to be returning, you are truly appreciated. Thank you so much and welcome back besties. Today we are still sticking with the theme. We are talking about spring fragrances. Spring has sprung. The flowers are blooming. The birds are chirping and this is spring season. I have 10 fragrances or so to share with you that are signature scent worthy. Soft life, clean aesthetic, pretty girl, all the things. If you want to hear what they are, please continue to watch here on this channel I do cover fashion beauty luxury and lifestyle all things fancy and fabulous dually so if that sounds like something that you'd be into or want to become a part of stop what you're doing drop me right now because you know I want to know what you're rocking what are you rocking today what is your scent of the day leave it down in the comment section I want to know if this seems like your vibe or your zhuzh go ahead and consider hitting the subscribe button don't stop there though I would hate for you to ever miss a video over here. So tap the notification bell. It will alert you every single time there's a new video on this channel. And if you wanna take it a step further, which I hope you do, come over and say hi on Instagram. I'm gonna put my Instagram handle right here. So pause the video, come over, follow me. If you're shy, come in the DM and say hello. Without further ado, we are jumping into this video right now. I have a new fragrance to share with you guys. Like I said, this was sent over by the team over at Michael Malou London. You guys, this fragrance is so beautiful. If you are in need of a fragrance, you want something new, you want something spring in a bottle, something beautiful, something signature scent worthy, something luxurious, something just like really gorgeous, really pretty, I would definitely encourage you to check out this fragrance. Like I stated, it is by the team Michael Malou London. Just look at the box. The box is actually pretty in itself. The fragrance is called Rose Plus Honey. I am matching this box today, dwelling. This fragrance is so pretty. I received it in the mail immediately. I went, I picked it up. I was like, I cannot wait to try this. Got it home, ripped off all the packaging, and I have been spraying it ever since. Just look at the bottle. A few of my favorite colors, pink, black, and the cap is gold you guys the mister on this is absolutely gorgeous let's take a look at it i'm gonna spray a blotter card here so we can see this i love it you can spray a little bit like that it's such it's a wide atomizer and it's very evenly distributed look at this you see that it's like a pressured atomizer girl it's good oh my gosh and the fragrance it opens up so fruity so fresh, so clean. I'm not really a floral girl. I mean, I am, but I'm not. You know, I like it hot and heavy. But I mean, with spring coming, summer coming, it is time to show the lighter side, the softer side. So that's what we are doing today. But this fragrance is so super, super good. I um sprayed it and I worked out in it because you know I have to try it out. I had to wear it out. So where do I go every single day? I go to the gym. So I wore this to the gym. It's really like pleasant. It's easy. It's an easy reach. You would wear this anywhere, anywhere, anytime, any place. Um, we're going to talk about some of the notes. It's just a beautiful fragrance. So congratulations to the team over at Michael Malou London. This is a really gorgeous fragrance. You guys, a few of the notes inside of it. Listen to the notes. It has strawberry, tangerine. I told you it's very fruity. Peach, it has rose petals. It has honey, cashmere, vetiver, amber, musk, and white caramel, which I have no idea what that smells like, but whatever it smells like, it smells really good. You definitely want to get a whiff of that. I just love the mister. Yeah, it's very fresh. It's very fruity. It's very but but pretty you know what i mean it's pretty if pretty was a person oh my gosh is that a song isn't that a song if pretty was a person if pretty was in a bottle this is how it would smell it's really pretty it's really pleasant um when it comes to longevity it's not a heavy hitter it's not beast it's not in your face it's not going to get there before you do it's none of that it is a beautiful soft fragrance with a moderate projection and longevity it got on me and lasts about, I would say about five hours. After about the five hour mark, I would say I had to really go in to really smell it, but it is really nice. For those of you that are looking for something that's not heavy, that's not in your face, that's different, rose plus honey, you do get the honey note in there as well, you would definitely enjoy this. It's just something that you can just reach and spray. You don't have to think about it at all. This is something you're just gonna take off your vanity tray and you're just gonna spray day or night, evening, as far as sex appeal goes, because you know I love a fragrance, especially if it's sexy. This is giving me first date 
kind of sexy is what I'm getting from this. I believe they have samples. I'm not sure, but I would say head over to their website. All of the information is going to be linked in the description box below where you can purchase this fragrance. And of course you do know that I have a 20% off discount code. If you don't, yes, I do. It is charade 20. All of the information of where you can find this fragrance will be linked in the description box below. So do not forget to check it out again. Congratulations to the team over at Michael Malou. This is a beautiful fragrance and thank you so much for sending it over. I am going to be getting my whole life this spring summer with this fragrance because you guys, it's one of those that I don't even think as much as I spray, I don't even think you can overspray it. Like I do not look at this. Do you see that? I don't even think it's just the mister on it for me. I don't even think you can overspray it. And one thing is that when I spray fragrances that heavy, I normally start sneezing. You see, I'm doing that and I'm not. It's so pretty. It's such a pretty fragrance. It must be experienced. So yeah, I would highly recommend getting a whiff of this if they have a sample or if you want to use my discount code and order a full bottle, definitely worth the whiff. I move on. I could have stayed on that all day, you guys, because it truly is that good. Again, like I said, thank you to the team over at Michael Malou London for sending that over. Let's step into this one here. I shared this with you guys before. I have been playing with it a tad bit more. This is Sherwood. This is by Memo. This is a beautiful fragrance. It's rich, it's creamy, it's got the sandalwood in it. This is what the bottle is looking like here. I absolutely love this. It is very rich, very creamy. It is so perfect and so fitting for right now. It's got a little bit of carrot seed, pink pepper, black currant rose sandalwood it's got cashmere and down in the base as well this is a gorgeous fragrance i do have a 10 percent off discount code with twisted lily should you want to pick it up and remember the thing about twisted lily is that they have samples as well so this would be a great place for you to try before you buy this is so uber good everything is like soft and pretty and pastel or rose petal it's like right there in that genre right there in that category it's not too in your face it's not doing too much that's why all of these are great for signature scents i move on of course you know that it couldn't go long without me talking about oriana i absolutely love oriana this is one of my absolute favorites okay when it comes to perfumes damali they're just all my favorites okay valaya is up there right now i'm sorry she has surpassed everybody oh my Oh my god did she surpass delina i don't know they're neck and neck they're running tied Valaya is off the charts, okay? If you do not have it, you definitely need to check it out. But this one here I'm featuring today in the signature scent worthy category, soft girl, soft aesthetics. This is Mandarin, orange blossom, black currant, whipped cream, marshmallows. Some have said it smelled like love, don't be shy. It's fizzy, it's glamorous, it's dressy, it's anytime, anywhere, any place. Definitely like um, spring break right now. Definitely if you were gonna go out, if you had like a night out or something coming up, this is something kinda fizzy in my opinion, is luxurious, is sparkling, it's feminine, it's youthful, it's playful, it's elegant. Oh my God, it's good, good. This right here is Oriana. If you do not have it and you have not tried it, I would highly recommend it. But you already know I'm gonna say start with a sample. Everything of where you can find a sample as well as a fragrance will be linked in the description box below. I move on. This one here is by the House of Siage. This is a beautiful fragrance here. This is Whispers of Truth, you guys. This is absolutely gorgeous. Many have compared it to Baccarat Rouge 540, like the whole entire world's been compared to Baccarat Rouge 540. But this has a different take on it, in my opinion. It does have some similarities. I won't even go as far as to say it does have reminisce of BR540, but this is much more fruitier in the beginning. It has bergamot. It's very fresh. It's very fruity. It's just a gorgeous, gorgeous fragrance. And oh my God, if my bottle wasn't so dirty, I could show you the cap. But I use this and wear this all the time. This is what the cap looks like. You know, their packaging is absolutely amazing. It may go on sale, so always check out the website. Rose, Jasmine, it has moss. It's just a beautiful, fruit, fruity fragrance. And it pairs really, really well if you mix this with Passion de l'Amour. That is my absolute favorite from the House of Siage. So if you have the two of those, I would say pair them together. But this is a beautiful signature scent worthy spring summer fragrance. And this time of year, it really shines. I move on. Now this is a classy, sophisticated, elegant, floral, fruity, signature scent worthy fragrance. And it is so gorgeous. It is by Roja and this is Elixir. I've talked to you guys about this before. This is actually going to be my scent of day. I'm probably going to mix it with something because as as beautiful as this fragrance is, it does not have the best longevity. So I typically will put on my moisturizer, a body cream. The one that I have uh, chosen today was the Fenty Vanilla Butter Drop. I could be making that up, but it's the Fenty one, the limited edition, the pink one with the rose gold specks in it. I put that on first and then I put this on and I'm probably gonna hit it 
again with something else on the way out. I maybe even will pair it with this just to see how that goes because these will blend nicely together. So here, if you want something and you're looking for something signature scent worthy, something very luxurious, blended to perfection, amazing high quality ingredients, just like luxurious or luxury in a bottle, I should say, this would definitely be a way to go. It's seductive, it's sensual, it's got bergamot, lily of the valley, rose de mai, it's got peach, raspberry, a little bit of everything in it, you guys, vanilla, musk, it has amber grit. It is a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. I cannot stress that enough. The only thing that for the price, I'm sharing it because like I said, I wanna, somebody may not feel this way. Somebody might be like, I don't care, I love it, I'm buying it. But I will say this, for the price, the projection, the sillage, the longevity of the fragrance is not there for me, but it is a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. So if you do not mind decanting it and taking it with you, one thing, and if you do not mind spraying heavy, two things this is a beautiful fragrance now if you have a problem with decanting and taking it with you this is not for you but for those of you that just want something luxurious and something beautiful and blended to perfection and luxury in a bottle this is definitely one to get a whiff of if i can find it at a discounted rate i will definitely link it down below I move on. Andromeda, I couldn't leave this out. You guys already know how I feel about this. This is absolutely gorgeous. If you are new to the channel, this is a beautiful fruity fragrance. I tried to put this in the date night category for me. However, for that date night, it didn't fit. But once I wore it to brunch and I wore it like a few other places, outings, I was like, okay, so it's fruity, it's floral, it's amber, it's peach, it's coconut, it's ebony, it's tonka bean, it's pear, it's, um it's just it's a it's pear blossom it is a beautiful fragrance if you have never worn andromeda i mean this is everything and talk about longevity the longevity on here is unreal the longevity the sillage the projection the compliments that come with it i mean this right here is good good and it is my favorite color this is white and gold i share this with you guys all the time i absolutely love it and then the bottle alone if you see the cap there the whole entire thing is just gorgeous i love this bottle and you can pick it up by the cap a lot of times when it's this heavily weighted if you picked it up by the cap it would fall but the bottle is made really well so i do like this i talk about andromeda all the time like i said none of these are really new except for rose and honey the rest of them i have spoke to you guys about but they are perfect for spring especially if you just want a one and done something that's like you're gonna be your signature scent this is a great list to choose from i move on tiffany rose gold now this you guys i will be honest i am a tiffany girl i love i love 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 tiffany it has a special place in my heart when i first picked this up i didn't have a love for it it was not a love at first sniff it was a like at first sniff. And even now, I don't reach for it as much. I had to have it in my collection because as I stated, I am a Tiffany girl. It has like a really sentimental moment and meaning in my um, heart for it. So I had to have it. But it is a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. It is rose, it's musky, iris, it's fruity, it's black currant. Um, it's a safe, I don't want to say a safe blind buy. It's good for any occasion. It's good for work. It's good for a work dinner. It's good for school. It's good for the gym. It's good for any occasion. I have not found this fragrance not fitting for any occasion. It doesn't have a whole, whole lot of sexy, but it's nice. It has like a first date kind of sexy to it a second date kind of sexy but if you're looking for something classy elegant it's tiffany um it won't break the bank to a certain degree but it's really nice and i love it and they have a, it has a nice i'm just loving these misters yeah it's really nice it's sparkling it's upbeat it's jovial it's classy it's timeless it's nothing groundbreaking earth shattering you've never smelled this before but it is really really nice and you know what i'm going to say i don't smell a whole lot of people like this i do not smell a whole lot of people like this so in that case i guess i would even say it's a little bit unique but it is like you know it's not groundbreaking earth shattering but it really is nice so if you need a new signature scent you want something in a beautiful bottle you want something you know that's gonna stand out i would highly recommend getting a whiff of this it really is nice 
I move on. Creed Windflowers is another amazing, beautiful, floral, signature scent worthy fragrance that can be worn to me anytime, but it really does shine in the spring and summer. I did receive this from the brand and I absolutely loved it when they sent it over. I played with it. I made a reel about it. I sprayed it all the time. This is a good airport scent too. A lot of times when I'm traveling, um, I try and find fragrances that are not going to, you know, disrupt anybody's peace, especially if I'm going to be sitting in close proximity of others. And I also need a fragrance strong enough that I can do one of these numbers if I need to pull my hoodie up and just like make it one of those kind of flight experiences as well. But this is Creed uh, Windflowers and this is really, really nice. You guys, when this first came out, the bottle had me because it's so different from Creed's original bottles. I love the, you know, the just the difference of it. It's just different. It's simplistic, but it's really pretty on my vanity and I do love the color. Of course, it's one of my other favorite colors. Like I said, all neutrals here. Iris Rose, Jasmine Peach, Orange Blossom, Sandalwood, Tonka Bean Rose. It's beautiful. It's going to give you a moderate six to seven hours. It's going to get on you, hold you tight. It's not a skin scent. It's really not going to go anywhere. Um, it's not beast. Oh my gosh. It's luxurious. It's not in your face. It's pleasant. It's gorgeous. It's absolutely gorgeous, darling. It is gorgeous. Oh my gosh. This would be a beautiful, a lot of times you guys are asking me, and I have that video coming, wedding day scent. This would be a gorgeous wedding day scent. This, girl don't start, cause we'll be here all day. But if you are looking for something and you have like a evening or afternoon or even morning wedding coming up and you're gonna do it in the warmer months, definitely get a whiff of this. This is absolutely gorgeous. And one beautiful thing about it, I don't know if they're still doing it, but you could even take it and have the bottle engraved and put your wedding date on the back. It's just like one of those moments that this was my wedding scent. I do those type of things. I'm really sentimental like that. So yeah, I would highly recommend this one. I move on. Another beautiful fragrance. Now this is really soft, but this is absolutely gorgeous. If you love gardenia, if you love strawberry, if you love something kind of romantic, very girly, very feminine, I'm gonna say it. I've been in the praises since it has come out and this is s boy by draco for her i love this fragrance you guys this is like pretty girls soft life i know it's all the things floral in a bottle it is absolutely gorgeous a few of the notes like i said it has mandarin strawberry it has gardenia rose it is just so gorgeous and it's so light and so fluffy and so airy that it's not gonna be in your face and when it's getting hot and sticky and you don't really want anything headache intrusive or headache inducing. You really want to make sure you're picking fragrances that are not going to um, do too much at the forefront. And this one right here really doesn't. A lot, most of the ones that I've shared with you today, like I said, they're soft light. They're really pretty. They're really, you know, sparkling. They're really feminine. They're really playful, jovial. They're gonna uplift your mood, but at the same time, they're not gonna be that hard, heavy in your face. This is definitely not the see, smell me before I get there. This is definitely not the smell me through the phone. This is none of that. This is soft girl, soft woman, soft bestie life. And this right here is really good. I love this one. I tell you guys about it all the time. Oh my gosh, it's good. Oh, it's the strawberry. It's the strawberry and the gardenia in here for me. This pairs really, really well if you have um, something like Eden Juicy Apple, it goes well with. I've mixed it with Crab Apple Blossom by Clive Christian. I've mixed it with a few other ones I've mixed it with. It just mixes well with any fragrance as well, or you can wear it on its own. It is a really beautiful, feminine, girly, uplifting, type of fragrance. I move on. And that is it. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel today. I truly appreciate you. All of the information of where you can pick up these fragrances and if I have any discount codes on them will all be linked in the description box below. So do not forget to check out the description box because all of the information is going to be in there. Again, thank you so much to the team over at Michael Malou London for sending over Rose Plus Honey. I really love this fragrance. I truly appreciate it and congratulations. Remember you guys, you can find this in the description description box as well, along with my 20% off discount code. Until next time, besties, you know the drill. Be blessed, stay fit, and definitely stay fabulous, darlings. Thanks for watching. Bye.